month ago, around now, two officers were beginning their shifts and would never go home. Lieutenant Michael Husak, Officer Michael Jensen were shot and killed in Salina. This afternoon, we do have some new information about the investigation into their deaths, specifically who's leading it. Let's go to Andrew Donovan now, who has that information for us, and it's really not a surprise, but it finally happened. Yeah, Christy, it was expected, but it happened quietly that the state attorney general is the one now investigating. Her office is investigating this, and that happened nine days after the AG herself attended one of the officer's funerals. State law requires an attorney general's review of any death caused by police. Officers shot and killed Christopher Murphy after he fired at them. The attorney general report will focus on his death, Murphy's death, but could include suggestions to benefit police in the future. A rough average calculated by News Channel 9 shows these reviews historically take about a year to finish. The Sheriff's Office and Syracuse Police Department are still jointly investigating themselves the night their officers were killed and hope to account for every deadly decision made that night. We have a, uh, a number of deputies second-guessing themselves. If I did this different, if I did that different, who should be here? And, and the facts um, just don't support that. There's nothing different that Hooch or anybody else could have done um, to, to change the outcome of this. Those local investigations that continue are important too. It will help determine where Christopher Murphy's guns and drugs came from and if anyone will be held criminally responsible with the prime suspect dead. Christy.